Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, viewers. Welcome to Gundam's Final Hour. There is only one possibility. You weren't in your room at the time. I applaud this man. I really do. That's why, even though you were staying in a deluxe room, you still went to the lounge. Am I right? Mm -hmm. Gundam, um, you oh, have some Sonya. sort of explanation, right? Gundam oh, probably Sonya. couldn't return to his room because of Fuyuhiko. He would have son. <laughs> you bastard. Do you understand the situation you're in right now? D do not panic. The truth shall now oh God. commence. Oh God, Gundam. At the time, I left my room to go to the bathroom. By coincidence, uh, you would have made a report, an account. That's right. That's all it was. The world is always so simple. Are you saying it was just a coincidence? And yet, I'm being suspected by all of you. It seems it was actually horrible. God damn it! Don't say, Sonia. Don't back him up. I see. You're still holding out. Hmm. Well, you don't have to admit it. We're going to decide who the killer is with the majority vote anyway. Yep. So, why don't we just go ahead and start voting? It's obvious that Gundam is the killer. Uh, please hold on. We have yet to hear Gundam's rebuttal. Yeah, has none. But he's completely shut up. Gundam! <laughs> I was simply at a loss for words after being dumbfounded by your pathetic assumption. In fact, I shall deny the very basis. Since the beginning? Hmm. Although going to and fro is busy enough as it is, how would I be able to travel between both houses anyway? The bloody trapdoor. Or if there was a secret passageway. There we go. That Finally get to use this. The only means of travel but No, Goodbye, that's Gundam. Wrong. Goodbye. The, the most misunderstood, misunderstood characters of all of Danganronpa. Such a method does not Shh. exist. I should have spent more time with you. Then why don't we ask the person who actually used that method? Nagito. You're the only one. Nagito, you should know. Huh? Shut don't up. play dumb. You appeared so suddenly that one time because you used that method, right? Mm-hmm. The trap door. Jeez. Once again, I let the reserve course show up. Yeah. But you're right. There's a door on the floor of the octagon, which is on the first floor of Strawberry House. Good. If they used that secret passage, they could have gone between the two houses as much as they wanted. If they complete the final death. Infinity Unlimited Flame! Are you going to do this? You're fighting, he's fighting till the very However, end. I have blood. the killer was unaware of the existence of the final dead room? Mm -hmm. There's no way they didn't know. That is merely an illusion you have fabricated from your own suspicion. <laughs> if you value your life. There's no way I can stop. What did you say? Don't make me angry. <laughs> you wouldn't like me when I'm <laughs> angry. All right. Yeah, we're going to rebel this. How do we prove that he was there? Could travel through multiple planes. Provided you use a spacious worm. Oh my god, I'm crying for my However, life here. How frail, frail, I say. I can't back down. <laughs> I already proved a secret passage exists. Hmm. The secret passage was at the octagon. Hmm. Killer went to the octagon. Don't bark, you cur. If you don't want to drown in the maelstrom of. There you Allow are. me to cut through those words. There's no wire around. The wire used to string up Nekomaru's body, the hammer that looked like the weapon, and the chain on the door in the top. Those are all the items that weren't in Funhouse. The only place I can think of is the Octagon. <laughs> God damn it, Gun them. Fight, keep on fighting. Fight to the bitter end. Normally, we'd end up listening to Hajime lecture us with a very long summary of the case. Thank God. Nagiro, please tell him we were skipping that. But there's no reason to waste any more time on this opening act. So I'm going to end this right now. Hey, what are you... First of all, <laughs> I'm messing with all the clocks in the building. So by pressing the good night button, he rendered Nekomaru powerless without fighting him. What was wrong? Hold on! You... What did you just say? That I didn't battle? Huh? What? Are you making it? Gundam, shut the fuck up! <laughs> What's wrong with that? Um, first, first amendment. My client didn't say, didn't say anything. Shut the fuck up. Don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. I cannot ignore those words. Why are you angry all of a sudden? 
You fools do not understand. You don't understand at all. Ha! You make me laugh. After all this time, you still don't understand anything at all. I don't understand anything. What does that mean? It appears I cannot finish just yet. Why? I cannot finish! I'm gonna use that line when <laughs> that level of determination. It's obvious I'm going to destroy your illusory assumptions. Panic talk action. Your words. You said I pressed Nekumaru's good night button. However, that button was on the back of Nekumaru's neck. To press it, I'd have to get behind him. It's not easy to get the drop on Coach Nekomaru. It's even more difficult if it's Poor a one-on-one -on -one situation. It's a five-on-one. Panic on talk, Ashton. Let's do this final battle. We'll fight you head on. Gundam will give you the battle you want. I won't let you. For the Tanaka Empire. Wither. This is so easy. Oh, yeah, I lost a single hit. For the Tanaka Empire. I'm just tapping. Wither. And then pressing uh, R1. As David prophesied. It's Nekomaru's for back. Dark do you really think I can get behind him so easily? <laughs> Damn it. The for Dark Davis. It's the for Dark Davis. Do you really think Davis. I can get behind him? This is the end. Goodbye, Gundam. <laughs> you put up a good fight. Even if you didn't get behind Nekomaru, you should have been able to press the button on the back of his neck. As long as you had the power of the hamsters you keep with you. Oh? Are you seriously saying he used his hamsters to press the button on the back indeed. of the Indeed, indeed, here you go. Just believe it, please. Of it yep, picked up a piece of cloth from Mikan's case. Hey, with your friends and their exceptionally smart brains, it must have been possible to secretly get one of them behind Mekamaru and press the button on the back of his neck. Hmm. How about it, Gundam? <laughs> Is that how it happened? <laughs> <laughs> How are you gonna go out, Gundam? Not just myself, but you actually brought up how splendid my subordinates are. <sighs> I have no recourse but to admit it. Um, 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 fuck. Uh, state law number 64. Uh, the, the right to silence. My client doesn't know shit. Admit it? Did you say. You admit it? My client is clearly confused. He doesn't know. He's clearly mentally unstable. He thinks he's like he's from the nether realm. Gundam did not. <laughs> it appears I've obtained a one-way ticket to hell. Damn, he's really gonna admit it. Fine! Then you must trample me underfoot and advance. He's just trying to teach, I guess. Pull the curtain strings of this worthless performance with your own two hands. If you say so, Gundam. If you really do say so. There we go. Here's everything that Done. happened in this case. All right, Gundam. That someone is Gundam Tanaka. And he's chill about it, too. Damn, my guy was like, good job. <laughs> splendid. <laughs> that was splendid. For a mere human, you did quite well. Stop. Stop it already. All right, see, are we going to let the feels hit? Stop using weird words to avoid the truth or I'll friggin kill you myself. I cannot right. believe it. I just cannot believe you. You killed Nekomaru. I cannot believe something like that. You don't wish to forgive me. Do you feel regret? Then finish it. Cast your impure votes for Gundam Tanaka. My beloved, deadly foes, let the voting time begin. I got went out like a G. <laughs> He's actually like, fuck it, kill me. All right. Fall, my tears. Why would you want to talk to someone who has lost? The loser merely leaves. It would be unnecessary for me to say something. Listen well. Is what I'd like to say, but for honor's sake, I shall correct one thing. Correct? How pitiful. You said I made Nakamura powerless without fighting him. However, that was a great mistake. Huh? Fine. Nakamura did fight. That is no mistake. Because he fought, he lost and died. D damn it! Lost and died? This too must be the will of If he was just clinging to life, there are many ways he could have done so. However, he did not allow that. Oof. Anime battle ensuing? Nakamaru and I were alone in a tower, standing face to face with one another. Hmm. 
Should I say I expected much from Nakamaru? He sensed my subtle killing intent and instantly understood the situation. He could have run away, could have called for help, but he did not turn his back on me. Instead, he chose a fight that risked life and death. Sensing even my subtle killing intent, as expected of you, Nekomaru. <laughs> this scorching, stinging, tense atmosphere. I've been a team manager for so long, <laughs> I'd nearly forgotten this. This is great! What a comforting atmosphere! Hmm, that's a great line. And what is your reason? Do you intend to resolve this situation by killing me? <laughs> I am the warlock. Gundam Tanaka, heroes, lords of darkness, and even the gods themselves flee from me. I do not cling to any trivial reason. I'm simply going to kill you because your very existence is an annoyance. <laughs> You'll drench your soul with evil until the bitter end, huh? Splendid! In response to your spirit, I shall kill you with all of my might. I won't go easy on you. Don't even think about holding back! Don't waste your breath on cowardly tactics! Give me everything you got! Nekomoro Nidai, your blood will drench the foundation of my empire! That is... Well, why did you fight? We're all friends. Why couldn't you stop this? Even if both sides agreed, it was still wrong. <laughs> I'll not argue. I have no intention of forcing my values upon you. Let me tell you. However, this. I must say this. What's the point of living if you're just waiting until you finally die? You weakling! There's nothing courageous about that. That is abandonment, a mere fleeing of resignation. If you flinch, you will die! Giving up on life is an insult to life itself. If you say killing is for the sake of living, is evil, then what would you call giving up on life itself? Oh. If a world would consider that justice, then I will fight that world with every last every last fiber of my being. Giving up on life and choosing death is nothing but a blasphemy toward life. You Are you saying that all to justify what you did? But... But it sounds like Nakamura felt the same too. That's why they fought, right? Damn it! Yeah, yeah shut up. Shut up, Akane. <laughs> Regardless, I said what I said. I did not intend to force my values upon you fools. I betrayed you all. That is the absolute truth. Fall, my tears. But even so, don't you think it's the better alternative to starting to death here? Oh. That belief is why you committed your crime? You... What about the final dead room? Did you use... Did you do this Russian roulette too? Oh yeah, my guy fully did the Russian roulette too as well. Let's make history. Unlike Nagito, I only did it once, but... <laughs> hmm. Compared to my battle with Nakamaru, that was mere child's play. Well? You know, after listening to you talk for a while, I'm starting to think that... Well, it's because you unexpectedly admitted to your crime without much resistance. Gundam, don't tell me you did the sacrifice f for our sake, did you? <laughs> I cannot believe you were asked such a foolish question. My name is Gundam Tanaka! History's greatest monster. My cursed existence is feared by all mankind. There's no way I'd sacrifice myself for the f sake of you fools. Fade like dust in the wind. Not in a million, billion, ten billion years. In the name of pandemonium, it is impossible. Is that it? I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> now then, let us be rid of this foolish talk. It's time the fun has started. <laughs> Manukuma, let us begin. Yes, indeed. We all know we don't need to say words, my boys. We don't need to say words. We know how it, it really is. Let's pay <laughs> respects to Gundam. Please wait. This is just too much. I beg of you. Please, Monokuma. Huh? Isanya. I beg of you. Oh God, she's gonna how get beautiful. hit hard. Miss Sonia. An act unrefined as stopping a man from going to his death does not befit a noble such as yourself. Uh. Gundam. Is that fine to start for reals, right? Fine. Yes, I do not mind, however. What is it, my four dark devas of destruction? Oh god. Oh god, don't pull out the fucking animals. Jesus. <laughs> Alright, I'm crossing my arms. Are you worried about me? 
Oh, my feared four dark devas of destruction. That is not like you at all. However, there is no need to fear. In this world, I am only a temporary visitor. I was simply visiting for a moment, <laughs> and now that my duty is complete, I must return to the darkness. That is why, until the very end, pride, conceit, courage, insolence, fearful of nothing, daunted by nothing, let us laugh uproariously! <laughs> That is Gundam Tanaka! I shall stick with my evil until the very end! Let's give it everything we've got! It's punishment time! Alrighty. Arms closed, everyone. Let us... <laughs> give it your best stare. No one better be crying. Bulls? Gundam Tanaka Stampede. Killed by animals. As an animal breeder. Alright, I see you, Monokuma. You little shit. Jesus, alright. I guess they, uh, they they got nothing to do with this. What do you pull that stick out of, my guy? Incantations? Oh, that shit's working. <laughs> what? What is it? It's not gonna do anything, is it? Oh, damn. Alright, the safe gun. What the fuck? <laughs> what? Animal heaven? Alright, he's going with the animals. Alright. Assume your rightful place with the enemies. Your mind, my boy. Why you two? Why want to go? Such a great thing. I'm gonna go get my chest out of there. Gundam. All right, that was one hell of a way to go out. I respect that. That was Gundam Tanaka's final hour. How did you enjoy that? How did you enjoy this class trial? I can say this was about 50 50 for me. I swear to god, if they cut out all the fucking mini games, this would have been a really great tra class trial for me. There's a lot of filler, a lot of stuff. Feels like Monokuma has become more of a pest than anything. Nagino's lost his charm. I really enjoyed the last bit. Really enjoyed Gundam's talk. I loved how Gundam stayed true to his character, how I envisioned it. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time on the next part of Danganronpa C, where this story heads out. Probably something to do with Nagito next. Because Nagito is Black Air Force. In the meantime, if you'd be so kind to check out my other playthroughs, such as my Elden Ring playthrough, my Katawa Shoujo playthrough, and my also the Eden Gardens playthrough. It's only two parts, but hey, it's a pretty damn well good fucking fan game of the Danganronpa series it is. Until then, see you guys next time.